assalam alaikum dear students and viewers today i will deliver a lecture on topic kinds of table this is for class 11th as you know that in my previous lecture i have explained in detail the tabular presentation of data what are the components of table and what are the guidelines while drawing a table or what are the features of good table now today we will discuss the kinds of table there are different kinds of table on the basis of their nature of information they contain is such as on the basis of purpose on the basis of purpose it is further divided into general purpose and second one is special purpose tables and second one is on the basis of originality of data it is further divided into number 1 original or derived table and the next one is on the basis of construction these tables are divided into simple table also known as one way tables and complex tables and these complex tables are further divided into two way tables and many fold tables the kinds of tables are on the basis of purpose which may be general purpose tables special purpose tables or on the basis of originality the kind of kinds of table are original tables or derived tables which have been derived from the original table or on the basis of construction the kinds of table may be simple one way having one characteristic complex which is further divided into two way means having two characteristics two variables and manifold tables having more than two characteristics or more than two variables now i will explain them one by one first we will explain on the basis of purpose the kinds of tables are on the basis of purpose number 1 general purpose tables it is also known as a reference tables or a repository table inka iska jo dusra naam hai wo hai reference table or repository table in these tables i mean in general purpose tables jiska dusra naam hai reference table ya repository tables isme jo hum information dikhate hain wo detail information hoti hai it contains a detailed information that is why it is known as general purpose tables it acts as a reference table for an investigator for a researcher for a student and these reference tables they are given at the end of a book aapne dekha hoga apne book mein at the end of book or end of dissertation 
that is a research publication it is not shown in the middle of the book or in a research publication such as dissertation but at the end of that publication because we have the researcher the publisher have made some important points in his publication has written some important points in his publication and he wants to give reference from which he has got that information then he gives a reference tips at the end of his publication Location, which may be a book or which may be a research publication. Example of these general purpose tables, reference tables or repository tables or census report shown in tables census report of India and last census report of India was published in 2011 it was done in the year 2011 this census and it census the census it takes after every 10 years therefore the next coming year to 2021 will be the census year And in this census report, a data is published on and information is given on such as, I will give here a glimpse view of the census table to make it more clear to you. For example, in this column, I will write status in this column, population of that state. literacy rate of that state success ratio population density this information is given in census report which is published by census commissioner and which is uh, which is published by director general and Census Commissioner of India under the Ministry of Home Affairs. And this census report, it gives an information on population of different cities or we can take population of different uh, districts, literacy rate of different states, different uh, districts, Likewise, sex ratio of different states, different uh, districts and population, population density of districts uh, different uh, states and different uh, districts is given it gives a detail and information of a state of a district of a country and uh, what is sex ratio it is a number of females per thousand males sex ratio is number of females per thousand uh, males this is known as sex ratio and what is population density population density it shows the number of this population density it shows number of persons per square kilometer kitne bande rehte hain per square kilometer mein usko hum kehte hain population density which is also published by this census report which is also published in census report published by census commissioner or we uh, sorry published by director general and census commissioner of india that these are the general purpose or reference tables it acts as a repository of information now on the basis of purpose we have special purpose tables Second kind of table on the basis of purpose is special purpose tables.
in special purpose tables we show we write a data having some special importance not a detailed information is given but a special information is given in a table that is known as special purpose tables it is also known as summary tables also known as summary because it does not give us digital information but it summarizes the special information from the general purpose tables i will give an example in case of summary tables for example there are many problems a society faces a researcher wants to study some problems of a society such as poverty unemployment illiteracy poverty garibi ek problem hai samaj ke liye unemployment berozgari ye bhi ek problem hai samaj ke liye illiteracy na khawangi ye bhi ek badi problem hai samaj ke liye at this poverty we can study at national level at country level at state level or at district level or we can also study at village level suppose a researcher an investigator wants to study only on poverty of a particular area and when he presents that data in a table which has only special emphasis on poverty of a particular area faced by a particular society that is known as special purpose table because special special emphasis on this problem study problem that's poverty or he may have collected the information on unemployment the data shown in the table is only on unemployment it means special the data is shown on unemployment berozgari or illiteracy therefore it is known as summary table is not a digital information but a special information is given in that table now on the basis of originality the kinds of table are on the basis of originality kinds of table are number 1 original table number 2 derived tables original table in original table the same data is shown same information is shown as collected by some or researchers some agencies and no and the data is not edited usme koi change nahi laate hum सेम फॉर्म में दिखाते हैं सेम वे में दिखाते हैं जैसे कि वो कलेक्ट किया गया है उसको हम कहते हैं ओरिजिनल टेबल्स फॉर एग्जांपल अगर हमारे पास जो रिपोर्ट्स है सेंसस रिपोर्ट है पब्लिशड बाय डायरेक्टर जनरल एंड सेंसस कमिश्नर ऑफ इंडिया व्हेन वी शो दैट डेटा इन द सेम मैनर इन व्हिच इट वाज शोन बाय दिस census report and we are not editing means we are not editing that information in the form of percentages in the form of ratios then it is known as original table original table of data and in case of derived tables we convert this original table we derive hum usko lete hain original table se then we edit fir usko main hum edit karte hain change laate hain such as we convert them into percentages ratios to make the data more simple more comparable that is known as derived tables for example from the census report we have data on population on sex ratio on population density on literacy etc now we want and this is a detailed information from the census report now we want to know 
some uh, information for example we want to know what is the sequence ratio of j and k and up we want to compare the sequence ratio of j and k and up we will derive this information from this original table from the census report there we will convert them into percentages into ratios to make a comparison between these two states or in terms of literacy suppose we want to know the literacy rate we want to compare between j and k state and madhya pradesh mp and we can convert this information into ratio into percent or we can make use of by applying i mean some statistical tools such as mean correlation regression or other statistical tools to make a comparison between different states different districts in terms of a particular data information that is known as derived tables jo hum derive karte hain dusre se lete hain now on the basis of construction of tables the third way of defining the kinds of table or on the basis of construction number 1 is simple tables in simple table we show only one characteristic for example here we have a table first column name of a person name of individuals and in this we will write age in years only one characteristic have been shown in this table that is age the variable is age therefore it is known as simple table or one way table and next one is on the complex tables two way tables i will draw a table to make it more clear to you the first column name of individuals second age in years and third height because age and height they are related and here we have shown two characteristics two variables such as age and height of individuals it is known as two way tables and another kind of table is many fold tables many fold tables in many fold tables we show more than two variables two characteristics age in the first call sorry name of persons in second column eight first characteristic second will be height and in third column we will write the weight of person here two more than two characteristics have been shown two more than two variables have been shown such as age height and weight these are known as manifold tables we can also give example of manifold tables for example if we are asked to give a data in the form of table in terms of number of students on the basis of class wise such as 9th class 10th class 11th 12th class this is one characteristic second one be one will be on the basis of gender such as boys and girls and third characteristic will be on the basis of stream such as auto stream medical non medical stream commerce stream these are the different characteristics different variables simply we can say different characteristics of a table that we which are shown in tables the information against those characteristics are shown in the tables and those are known as manifold tables and there are many examples on this manifold tables hope 
you have understood it. Thank us.